Hi guys, this is Steve Pavlonis with LifelessAnxious.com. Today we're going to talk about something I receive emails on all the time. People come to our website asking questions about it. How can I calm myself down? How can I stop a panic attack when one starts to arise? You know, I feel like I'm going to lose it. I feel like I'm going to pop or lose control. How can I calm myself down? This technique we're going to talk about today involves breathing and, and muscle tensing and relaxing. And this was my go-to favorite technique when I was suffering from panic attacks. I used to get panic attacks on airplanes, stuck in traffic on buses or trains, uh, elevators, anytime I felt stuck and I couldn't escape physically. I'd also get them in many social situations, uh, public speaking, dating, talking to a boss or superior, a police officer, things like that. People get them in all sorts of situations. Um, I'm sure you have some. What we're going to talk about today can be applied in any situation for anyone. It will calm you down in any situation. So what you're going to do is when you really are just starting to feel super anxious and like you're going to lose it, you're going to take a deep breath in through your mouth, really fill your lungs up and hold it. And while you're holding your breath, you're going to tense every single muscle in your body from your toes through your legs up to your midsection, your neck, your face, hands, squeeze everything. Five to ten seconds as hard as you can while you're holding your breath in and then going to relax every muscle in your body at the same time and slowly exhale. You will be amazed at the wave of just tension and fear and stress that just leaves your body immediately. Now what we're doing with this is tapping into our body's parasympathetic nervous system. Think of it as a built-in relaxation system that all of our bodies have. Like our body knows how to make its own volume. It's a way to calm yourself down without having to rely on medication or having to go to a doctor. This can be used anywhere. I've used it in so many situations. Uh, waiting to introduce myself to a group full of, like a room full of 30 colleagues at a training session. Uh, you know, I would do my breathing techniques to calm myself down before I had to speak to the group. I've done it on dozens of flights throughout the years. Um, dating situations, I've done it. Stuck in traffic, trains, buses, you name it. It really does work. So again, you're going to take that deep breath in, hold it, tense every muscle, and then Relax as you slowly exhale. Now, even when I was having bad panic attacks, I found that doing this just once was enough for me to calm myself down and know I wasn't going to lose control or have a panic attack or freak out. Uh, you may find if you still feel anxious after you do this once, do it again. You know, do it every one or two minutes. And I think, you know, if you just keep after it, no matter how anxious you're feeling, it will go away. Like I said, once was enough for me, even when I was really, really, really bad. So for more tips and techniques and ways to reduce stress and anxiety in your life, uh, visit alifelessanxious.com. Link is below. Sign up for our email list. I like to send out all sorts of free resources. Again, it's all free. Um, you know, that can help people just like you. Learn how to calm yourself down and, and lead a life less anxious. This is Steve Pavlonis with alifelessanxious.com. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.